What is going on, you guys? This is Ultron 2. The Mobile 2 to Ultron 2 show. Coming out July by the power of the internet. And guys, we have an Xbox One here. I brought, this is my brother's Xbox One. He bought it off of eBay. So we're going to see if it's actually in the box. So, my brother, open that up. So we're going to start with the games first. So, he bought Grand Theft Auto 5 for Xbox One. This. And now we have another one. So guys, I know I said this in the past. Not really an Xbox guy, but I don't mind buying one. Um, I guess since he has one, we can all play Fortnite. So. And by the way, I sent you... I, forgot, I didn't tell you this, but I sent you like a gift from... Um, to your uh, account for Fortnite or something. I forgot what it was. Luckily, they have that where you can actually send gifts to people, so... Yeah, guys, and in the future, I will be doing giveaways. Until I get, like, enough money, I will be doing, like, a PSN giveaway, because, like, all my friends have PlayStation, so... I'll do that. Just a gift back. I mean, even though I'm selfish, I don't mind just giving something away. So, guys, we got... Says... Diaz X, uh, Mankind Divided Day Day One Edition. So this is Xbox One. So and it's brand new. Yeah. I mean, you could talk. Like, how much did you pay oh, yeah, for it? So, uh, the seller he actually gave me a really good deal for it. Uh, four fifty, I think. Yeah, I got guys, four fifty, and it's brand new. How much? You probably don't like. Do, do you know? Um. The retail, or you don't eBay. No, no, I mean not retail, but like the retail price. Uh, no, I do not. It's probably sixty dollars as usual. So he got that game, and now we're about to unbox a box in the box. So hopefully he's in there. So and guys, in the future I will do a video about Xbox One versus PS4. Um, I already did enough research to make a video on that. Same thing with all the iPhone videos I've done. People ask me questions and stuff, and I always answer. Um, I did numerous iPhone videos. Those videos I got thousands of views. I, that's really good. So we're gonna see if it's actually in here, and I'm gonna recommend for those who don't have a, a PS4, or Xbox One, if they should buy one. Um, I'm putting the camera down just in case if there's any or address. Because they usually put that in a video. Does it have the address on it? Just have the prize. So, okay. So here is a paper standard ground shipping. So he paid 120 bucks for this. Um, so, yeah. That's the paper that they usually get. And then there's a card here. Um, Return policy guarantee that type of stuff. They always used to give that. So and this is kind of nice wrapping paper. So and he did buy the original Xbox One, just like when I bought the original PS4. So let's see it. Okay, I think it's in bubble wrap. Okay, I think that's it. Let's see something. So let's start off with that. So here is the Xbox One controller. Um, I've, I I held this controller before. It was comfortable because the um uh, oh yeah I've got the three six controllers in um a mom's room. But um sold it. Got oh yeah man he sold the uh, three sixty. He had like a stack of games and all that stuff. GameStop like he went to GameStop tried to trade it in. He had like 30, at least over 30 games. He had a complete system, all that stuff. And he said, how much? You can s tell him. Well, I had 30 plus games and they accepted about 25 of them, I guess you could say. So I traded that in. I traded two of my controllers, a charge and play kit. And yeah. Yeah, that's it. And I got 80 bucks for it. Yeah, all of it. 80 bucks, man. 
I mean, they couldn't accept the console just because it had a little crack in it. It was nothing too serious that was going to affect the console, but it was yeah. just a t little Something crack. Something feels weird about the D-pad. And then... It feels like... I think the left button is stuck or whatever. Um, no, it's supposed to be like that. Like, like the, it is? The, Are you sure? I don't think it is. It's probably jammed or broken. I don't know. But, I mean, it is used, so... I mean, you get what you get for your money. So, of course, they have the standard battery packs. <laughs> Guys, let me know. Let me know. Um, what, well, hold on. I'm showing. But, um... Uh, guys, let me know down in the comments what you guys think. Do you guys like controls with batteries, without batteries? Um, even though, like, on a PlayStation, like, when you charge them, you could charge, like... If you charge them up for, like, a minute, then you could reuse them. But, like, I feel... Some people f say that when you just... Put, put in batteries, you could just automatically just get the plane. But it's a nice, comfortable controller. But I would do a review on that later, another time. So here are the cords right here. And we're actually, and guys, we're also going to show you um, him actually hooking it up to see if it actually works and everything was fine. Um, it would be cool if they gave him the connect because, like, I mean, yeah, the like the connect, like when you have the connect, you can actually use the voice commands. So, yeah, so those are the cords. Um, uh, so what's this HDMI cable? So that's the HDMI cable, power cable, all that stuff. So yeah, and the power brick. So if you get an Xbox One S then or the X, you don't have to worry about that. So, yeah. And then here's the Xbox itself. Yeah, I'm trying to be really careful in this video. So, alright, moment of truth, guys. Oh, yeah, we're also going to test see if that controller works. Wait, keep that controller real quick. Just to see. Because when I cut the video, I'm going to see, like, how comfortable it is. Well, guys, basically, this is a big improvement from the 360. Because every time I will play Black Ops 1 on the 360, like, it will, like, my middle finger will feel numb and it just hurts. So, new and improved. Alright, tell me the truth, guys. And this was 120 bucks. I've seen a guy selling an Xbox One S controller, console, and everything for like 130, 140. Thank you. So, oh, uh, oh yeah, cause I'm gonna show. You. Yeah. So here's the Xbox One here. I, I don't want to show like this part because it's gonna reflect and show my face. Guys, as you guys know, I wear a mask, so I don't want to expose anything like that. So. Here's the Xbox One proof. So yeah, guys, if you want a face reveal, that's gonna have to wait till next year. So, so here's the Xbox One, the original one, the day. This is actually the day one edition. That's what it's called. So, of course, you have the HDMI. Oh, let me focus that. HDMI out. You have the power cable slot. Uh, HDMI in. Um, you have the C you have two sync cables right here. Um, there's like a lot of ports on the Xbox. Even a PS4 don't even have all that. This is for the Kinect. Oh yeah, that's for the Kinect. Ethernet. And the Ethernet cable. Um, so yeah. I don't know if Ethernet's supposed to be better than wireless internet connection. I mean... I mean, I think it really depends on like how your Wi-Fi is. Yeah. But, yeah. One day I'll do a comparison video about PS the Xbox One controller and the PS4. So, yeah, guys, there is something to step back. So, yeah, guys, I'm going to cut the video and we're going to set this up. All right, guys, we set up the Xbox. We're about to see if it actually works and stuff. And I'll have to cut the camera for, um, because he has to set up his account. Well, not set up his account, but he got to uh, put it, his account on this Xbox One. And he already has an um, Xbox account. 
Um, guys, if you have an Xbox, whatever, um, hit me up. Uh, let me know where your gamer tag is, and I guess I can add you or whatever. Um, I know some of my followers, subscribers. On Instagram and on YouTube, um, be hitting me up. We've been playing Fortnite. Uh, but I also want to play other games, too. So, yeah, so I'll turn on the Xbox. We're going to see if it works. Oh, left there. Turn it off, so I'm going to cut it again. What if I'll cover the camera for it? Okay. Oh yeah, guys, for uh, for privacy reasons, I don't want to show my brother's face on camera because I respect you. I don't film people without the permission. But let's see. Let's see. All right. It works. It actually works. All right, guys, we have the Xbox turned on. Everything works. Hmm. Great deal. So, uh, I think all you gotta do is set up the controller works, right? You put batteries in there. Okay. So, guys, you turn on the controller. He's about to see if it. Alright, right, you good. Oh. Um, uh, so I have a pair here. Controller. I think there's some. Oh, he's putting the controller in front of the Xbox. I think that's how you pair it. I don't know. I don't know how that works. So it looks like my brother's been doing his research. So, alright, I'm about to I'll cover the camera. So. Yeah. So I've seen videos of this. So that's how you set it up. So you have that. So everything that shows on screen, you gotta actually press it. So it's, ba it's technically a test. So you gotta actually press the button. You gotta tap it. So, uh. He set it up. My friend, I'll cut the camera again. All right, he set it up. So press A. You gotta keep pressing. Yeah. So. Oh, they put it in a different language. Yeah, he's gonna set that up in a different language. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. U.S. Alright. Which one is yours? Oh, why was he? Uh, yeah, cover that. Can't leave none of that out, man. I love him, though. Oh, it never works. Look. Look. See that? Oh, it's just like the slightest touch. Yeah. Oh, so that's another thing. So the controller is actually sensitive. No, 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 it's just this part. Oh, the D-pad is actually kept sensitive, so that is, that's actually pretty interesting. You never, I didn't, I, I honestly didn't even know about that. No, it's just the part that's kind of messed up. Oh, oh, that part? Oh, okay. So, I thought the, uh, the left, like the D-pad, like the left, um, click thing was broken, but it's, unfortunately it's not. I thought it was. So, sorry guys, I have to cover the camera. Putting in the Wi Fi code. Oh, yeah, I do have a computer, guys. Oh, well, you guys already know that, but um, I said this in my last video. I did say that it's actually easy to, to pair that your Xbox 360 or one controller to a, a laptop. It, especially if it's HP or any Microsoft computer. I have an HP computer, so you can usually pair that up to my like computer. Up, up, up. But guys, I will be doing a challenge uh, where I play Fortnite with my uh, wireless keyboard and mouse. Because, unfortunately, 
on Xbox, they actually banned it where you can't use mouse and keyboard, which fortunately sucks because compared to that, uh, Microsoft do let me take away a lot of stuff. I mean, I, so. looked, I looked up a way on the, on YouTube. I was watching a YouTube video, and there there was a way. But yeah, the guy he mentioned it, Microsoft banning it, but it was something that he had to buy. Something I have to that, but just yeah. just look it up. So they had to buy to connect to the console and then plug in the things, and you were able to use it like that. Yeah, guys. Uh, had to buy some separate piece. When the Xbox World first came out, like I even heard about this. Like I watched IGN news. I heard that uh, when it first came out, there was like some used game policy where you had to pay a fee for used games on the Xbox One, like the day one edition, like when it first came out. But they actually they got rid of that and they actually changed it. So yeah, guys, very disappointing. Um, but. They've been fixing stuff. So, yeah. Excuse me. So, I'm going to cut the camera again. And, yeah, I don't want to dry this room any longer. But, yeah, so. And what is this? 500 ter uh, gigabyte hard drive? Mm -hmm. or 500? Alright. So, 500 gigs. Um. Uh, I guess I'll download Fortnite. Uh, I tried playing Apex, even like low key. Like when I streamed Apex on YouTube, the game was uh, cool, but like I don't like the game. Like I'm not gonna lie, people have been saying, "Ooh, all right, guys." Um, he set up the Xbox, so everything works. So guys, you get what you get for your money. Uh, so you pay 120 uh, for. The Xbox One off of eBay, and I, you guys know I bought my PS4 off of eBay as well. Um, great deal. Uh, I thought it probably wouldn't work, or whatever, but eh, great deal. <clears throat> and I heard that they're gonna update the the. Uh, they're supposed to be updating the Xbox home screen thing. I think they already did that. Yeah, I think they already did that. I think it's but, like this how they do. So it works perfectly fine. The controllers in great condition. Uh, even though everything is used, of course, console is in great condition. Nothing's damaged. Uh, there is no signs of glitching or pausing, none of that stuff. And play Halo, guys. My brother hates Halo. I play Halo, and that's one great game. But it's the game's kind of complicated, but it's still a great game. But yeah, so the console, everything works great. So. Yeah, guys, and for those who don't know, I do technology videos as well. I don't just do stop motion videos, Beyblades, that type of stuff, because, yeah. I like to experiment. I experiment with videos. Um, I make stuff that I think is going to get views uh, this well. Uh, so, yeah. So, he got his store on eBay. Great steal. I bought myself off eBay. Great steal. And the seller who actually... Who I bought my stuff from, he actually bought a PS4 Pro, and he said that because of that, he actually wanted to just get rid of his regular PS4 since he bought a Pro. I probably would have done the same thing too, because what's the point of having a Pro and the original PS4? So he just sold it, and he just gave it to me. And he said he just bought the PS4 not too long ago, so technically it makes it seem like I actually have a brand new PS4. So that actually is pretty good, so... Even though, even though it was used because he played on it, he, he did say that he just bought it. But, yeah, so, yeah. So, yeah, guys, I'm going to make a video about Xbox One vs. PS4, like, which one you should get, whatever. So, I'll make that another time. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Ultra 2 out, and peace.